Hello everyone! Greetings from Kharkov, Ukraine. My name is Svetlana Mucha and I am the leading matchmaker and dating coach at Dola.com. As you can see and as you have promised before, we are filming more of Olesa in our videos, so our leading psychologist is joining me today. And a topic is quite tricky and I believe truly controversial. Today, As always. <laughs> yes. Today we will speak about Ukrainian ladies and we will compare age groups of ladies. Actually, we will compare ladies in their early 20s with ladies in their late 20s and early 30s. So guys, I hope you are truly excited about this topic. Let's begin. So, Alessa, I have prepared a list of questions for you. So let's start. What you would tell about a desire for a gentleman in his 40s or 50s to date a mature 24 years old girl with an old soul? Um, well, I can say that I understand this desire. Why not? We already made um, a video about this topic, yes? But I can uh, say that I don't know girls in their early 20s who have an old soul. Can you define an old soul? Is there such a definition, such a term in psychology? I don't know. I don't know what it is. <laughs> no. So it's like looking for a unicorn, right? Yes. Okay. So my next question for you would be, uh, what is the biggest difference between an average lady in her early 20s and late 20s? Uh, I can say that there are a lot of differences between this um, group uh, of ladies. Uh, I will tell uh, that the ladies in their early 20s, uh, they don't have desire to have a family. And this is the main um, differences between them for me. Uh, because the ladies in their early 20s, uh, they concentrate on their future, on their profession, occupation. They try to find themselves in their lives and they don't think about family. And ladies in their late 20s? They are more open to have family, to have children, that is more important for us, yes. And uh, ladies in their late 20s, they are ready to move to another country. Because ladies in their early 20s, uh, they don't think about um, family, they don't ready to have some responsibility for their husband, children, etc. Uh, because they think um, that um, they have a lot of years uh, in their life and it's not the right time to concentrate on a family. Uh, can you tell that ladies in their 20s don't date? Because no, they I have date, seen that they, they actually date. date. Uh, they, can, they can be very active in dating, but uh, they date uh, not to have a family, but to have a relationship. And uh, if, uh, for example, a um, gentleman in their 40s who want to date a ladies in uh, her early 20s, uh, he should understand that she doesn't want to have a family. She wants to have a very romantic relationships with a big bucket of flowers, with some romantic dates, but not family. So no continuation? No. Uh, I can say that ladies in their early 20s uh, when I ask them, please tell me uh, what are you looking for in a gentleman, very often I hear an answer that mm, he's supposed to be beautiful and we will have very beautiful photos together. Oh, that's quite interesting because one of the questions that I have prepared for you is uh, what are the main qualities that ladies in their early 20s name they are looking uh, for in a gentleman mm -hmm. and lady in their late 20s, early 30s. I can say that ladies for. in uh, early 20s, they are looking for appearance, they are looking for some adventure in their life, but it's not about, uh, um, I don't know, soulmate. So the man has to be poster beautiful. Yes, yes, beautiful. I mean, beautiful um, appearance, not personality. And what about ladies in their late 20s? I can say that ladies in their late 20s, they don't think as much about appearance as ladies in their early 20s. Because they pay a lot of attention on personality, 
on similar interests, goals in life, uh, priorities, but not about appearance. But does it actually mean that uh, looks doesn't matter for them at no, all? No, no, of course. Of course, appearance is always important, but not as much as for ladies uh, who's 20, 20 or 21. 21. So uh, we can uh, conclude that for a girl who is, let's say, 20, 21, the looks would be a number one priority. Yes, of course. And she would be looking for of a course. partner. Yes. Uh, will it matter much that, for example, a gentleman is, let's say, well-established or rich or super smart? And not always. If she is 21. Mm -hmm. So she, she will choose a, a beautiful, handsome yes. surfer instead yes. of the yes. businessman. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then another tricky question that I have prepared for you. Uh, qualities we have already discussed. What is the attitude to marriage of a 21 years old girl and a 31 years old girl in average? Uh, 21 years old girl, she doesn't want to have a family. She doesn't want to have such responsibilities in her life. She doesn't know how to be a wife and she even can't imagine this. And um, I mean in average, yes. But ladies uh, in their early 30s, for example, or late 20s, they understand that they are ready, uh, they um, have uh, some life experience and they know what they want in their lives and uh, they know how to achieve it and yes, they are ready for family. I can comment that, that pretty often if the lady is, let's say, 29, 28 or 31, she has already uh, changed several jobs, she has tried herself yes. in several fields and for example, she came up to the conclusion that Okay, like climbing the career ladder is not for me. I would really prefer to be a wife, to have a job, but not really a career. Yes. And pretty often when we are talking to girls who is 19, 20, 21, uh, she has so many ambitions to be the entrepreneur, to be the beautician, uh, to be the teacher, to be the I can say that ladies in there, uh, if she is, for example, 21, uh, very often she is still a student and she doesn't know how to uh, realize herself uh, in her future life. But ladies uh, who are 20 or 28, 29, 32, for example, there are not a lot of difference between them because, yes, they can change a lot of jobs, uh, they know what they want, uh, they understand who they are. By 21 in Ukraine, a pretty often lady, they still live with their parents, so yes. it's not like or it is, let's say, in the US or in Germany, uh, when uh, kids move out from the house to go to college or to go to the university. So pretty much at 21, uh, she has never have had a real job. She's, she's still living with her parents. Yes. So she's quite sheltered from uh, the real life. And uh, she's just assuming what it would be like to have a first Actually, job. Actually, I can say that uh, uh, 21 years old, it's a child in Ukraine. That's true. Very often that's true. And uh, right now, gentlemen will tell, okay, 21, she is a child. 22 is okay. <laughs> 24, she is a mature, she is an old soul, she will appreciate a 48 years old I don't gentleman. understand what is an old soul. <laughs> I don't understand what it is. If I have, uh, if I have, if I have actually received like a dollar every time I have so heard, so we are, we have an old, an soul. old soul, yes. I, I don't, I don't understand this definition. <laughs> like so often, guys tell me that I want to date like a really mature and old soul trapped in the twenty-three years old body, and I think it's similar to dreaming about I don't know the original whore. I'm sorry, <laughs> <laughs> but it's kind of. Maybe it exists somewhere, but nobody has met anything like that. I don't I know. Think. I don't know. <laughs> Alessa. Do you have more questions? <laughs> yes, actually I do. Let's speak about kids. Okay. So often guys uh, in their 30s, in their 40s, in their 50s tell that I don't want to date a lady who is like 29 or 30 because she will have problems conceiving kids. So I want to date a 22 years old. For sure, she knows how to be a great mother. Can you comment this? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. She doesn't know how to be a great mother. <laughs> and she doesn't want to have kids at 22, yes. guys. Yes. Very often, 22, uh, it's, it's very early to have kids, to have a family. I can say that 
even 28 or 29, not all ladies want to have children at this age. They are not ready. It doesn't yes. mean that they don't want to have them at yes. all. I can say that this, this is true. Ladies in their uh, late, uh, uh, early 30s and late 30s, yes, they want to have children for sure. I can say almost 100%. It is interesting, uh, many gentlemen in their early 30s uh, and ladies, like I would call it middle 20s, 25 to 26, their attitude to having a family and have it, having kids is quite similar. So they are not quite sure that they want to have kids like straight away, they are still exploring their possibilities. Mm -hmm. But pretty often if the gentleman is in let's say late 30s, 40s, I'm not even talking about 50s, and he wants to have kids like tomorrow, uh, because uh, time is ticking and it's a priority for him. I believe that if he will choose a younger bride, then for sure she will give him kids. Mm -mm. I have, in 10 years, I can't think of a lady uh, in her early 20s who would visit my office and tell me that, oh, I desperately want to have a child. No. Yesterday I was actually talking to a lady who is 36 and she said that for her having a kid is a priority. Uh, she has achieved everything she wanted in her career, uh, she has traveled, uh, she has uh, close friends, uh, she doesn't have a love of her life yet, she, doesn't meet, uh, she hasn't met uh, the right partner, uh, but for her having a kid is a priority for the next several years. So pretty often... Because she has a lot of life experience and she has something to give to a child. She knows what she wants and I would tell that, I can't tell that ladies in their early 20s, they don't know what they want. They just want so many things at so once. So many, yes. I Traveling, don't know. I career, this, studying. This, this and this and nothing. Mm -hmm. So you interview uh, lots of ladies daily. Uh, what is your conclusion? Uh, which age groups should gentlemen consider if they are looking for a lady who is ready to marriage? late 20s and up <laughs> it depends on the age of gentleman if the gentleman is let's say 28 what is the perfect age and he wants to get married 25 so you wouldn't go below 25 mm -mm. same here let me check if i have another provocative question for alicia of course check <laughs> alicia what is the attitude to money of a girl who is 21 mm -hmm. and of the lady in her early 30s? Uh, interesting question. I can say that ladies in their early 20s uh, very often, as you say, they um, doesn't have a working experience in their life and they uh, don't know how to earn money. So they um, don't know the value of money. Uh, so they can't appreciate it and they can't save them. Yes, yes. They just, um, I buy what I want and I get what I want and that's all. But ladies in their late 20s, they um, know how to earn money and they can save it. Because they had some experience yes. in life. They went yes. to a job and they were not paid, mm -hmm. they were fired, so there was uh, not everything was a row this and bubbles. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me check another provocative question for Alicia. Of course. <laughs> uh, what is the attitude to possible relocation? And here I would ask you to compare a girl who is 21, 27 and 35. I can say that I don't uh, see very big difference between ladies uh, in 27 and 35. Yes. Uh, they both are ready to relocate, but ladies in their tw tw early 20s, uh-uh, not all ladies, uh, because they, um, it's about life experience, uh, they hope to find love here, locally, to date some locally, to have, uh, to be near their families, friends. Influence of the family, can you comment this one? Yes, of course, ladies uh, in their early 20s, they feel a big influence of a family, their parents. It's very important because a lot of them are still students and they depend on their family, of their parents totally. 
about ladies in their late 20s, it, it, it doesn't much about influence of parents. It's about uh, more about themselves. Because pretty often they live on their own, uh, yes. they earn their own money. Yes, so they have their own life. They are responsible for their own decisions. Mm -hmm. But not ladies uh, who is 19 or 20 or 21. How can you comment on those numerous profiles on male the bride's dating sites when a 19 year old know. girl... I don't know these profiles, I won't comment. She wants to date someone who is 60-65, do you think it's real? I, I think this is uh, not real, this is uh, some... something, no, so unicorn. This is a marketing, uh, yes. good marketing to attract more customers probably. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, we hope you have was... some more questions. No, I was actually <laughs> ready to wrap it up. Uh, I hope nobody has fallen asleep while watching it, though we are not sure in which time zone you are actually watching this video. As you can see, uh, we are quite a fun team, mm -hmm. uh, but we still do have enough wisdom and enough experience. We have been doing it for 11 years. And we truly believe that this video was useful and helpful for you and funny. Funny, <laughs> and the picture look good. So if you have any questions or any ideas which topics we should cover in the upcoming videos, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel and leave your comments and questions below this video. Uh, Svetlana Muha, Alisa Balichenko from Diola.com with love. <laughs>